Soon after Senior Principal Magistrate Liz Gicheha granted the prosecution leave to amend the charges against the eight suspects on the basis that the previous charges were defective, the hearing of the case kicked off. First to take the witness stand was Onesman Sanzomo, an employee of the Treasury who told the court 13 firms had participated in the tendering process. Gladys Shulei, Kakai Kisinga, Martin Okwata, Benedict Abongo, Wycliffe Wanga, Nicholas Muture, Nicholas Mbemba, and Thomas Olo attack are facing four counts of abuse of office and four counts of willful failure to follow procurement laws, thereby improperly conferring a benefit to Team Cells Limited for construction of prefabricated court buildings in different parts of the country. Meanwhile, the High Court has dismissed an application by businesswoman Esther Pasaris that sought to compel the Registrar of Political Parties to register her party, Harambe Democratic Party. Justice Mudoni, while dismissing the case, said she needs to get express permission from the minister before using the name Harambe. Elsewhere, four suspects charged with defrauding 12 M-Pesa agents in Maralel town have been released on a 2 million shillings bond each. The accused, Patrick Ouma Odongo, Ann Wambui Chege, Steve James Nyamari, Carl Williams Otieno and Abel Deuri Masharia denied 12 counts of theft when they appeared before Maralal Principal Magistrate Richard Koich. They are said to have defrauded the agents over 500,000 shillings on diverse dates between September 9th and November 4th, 2016. The hearing is set for 18th December 2016. Lilian Otieno for Scales of Justice.